Hey everyone, how are you doing? Today we're going to be checking out a demo of a game that's fairly new called Outriders. It has a little bit of a resemblance to Destiny because, you know, it's that type of looter shooter, increasing your power level and that type of game. And it's developed by People Can Fly, the same developer that had a lot to do with the earlier Gears of War releases. And I have seen in a little bit of Outrise gameplay where the cover system resembles that same cover system uh, that Gears of War is actually really famous for. But I mean, seeing and playing are two different things, so we'll have to see how that feels. Overall, just super keen to finally give it a go. And now that we've got the news that it's coming out on Day Pass Game 1, there's really no need to hesitate. That's pretty sweet. So from what I've heard, people either love it or hate it, but based on what I've seen so far, I'm going in pretty optimistic. Also, before starting it up, I just wanted to say I don't usually play or start demos of games that I want to play in the future, just because in an unfinished state, they might give a bad impression. But the developers have already pretty much said that the demo is in a pretty much finished state, and any progress made in the demo will completely be carried over into the main game. So that's pretty cool. So now that uh, you know my impressions of it so far, let's uh, jump in and check it out. Today, we shall see victory! A great new altar fights at our side! I feel a storm cloud coming down today. The anomaly should have killed us. But instead, it left us something more. Altered and Outrider. Only we can lead them to a future. Whatever we were before, we're something new now. We were given a second life. We can't waste it. Alright, here we go. So it seems like some sort of natural disaster happened and turned them into what they are now. So what are we going to do? We're going to do man or female, we'll do, we'll do male. Okay, customize character. I think the first one actually looks okay. This is more something I think that resembles my my hair. So we we'll go for the beard. Ah, uh, love me a beard. Alright, here we go. Something like that, a little bit of stubble. Maybe this a little bit longer. Oh, I like the longer one. I think we'll go with the brown here. Looks good. All right. Create a character. Name. All right. Uh, here we go. Rolfie. Here we go. Save character. Thank you for playing the demo. Okay. Before you land on Enoch, there are key things to be aware of. The demo encompasses the opening a chapter of the game in full. Any progress you make can be carried over to the main game. Okay, we already we already talked about that. There are many side quests and areas to explore. You'll be introduced to all early game mechanics. Uh, those systems such as crafting will only unlock when you travel beyond the demo area. Drop in, drop out, co-op will become available once you have selected your class. Please see the news tab for more info on multiplayer and crossplay. Okay. So online, friends, join, lobby, news, new beginning, select a story point. World of Tear? What's this? Enemy level, dropped item level, loot, rarity, modifier, legendary, drop rate, modifier, bonus. Oh. I wonder if you can only unlock a different world tier once you've beaten the game. Or in this case, beaten the demo. Or if you can just change it when you want. Yeah, okay, so it is locked. How do you unlock it? Permanent lock. Okay, so do I have to defeat the first world tier? The first story part to unlock the, the next bit? Oh, I'm not sure. I guess we'll find that out once we start playing. So let's, uh, oh, here we go. We can select the, uh, okay, yeah. This is obviously for once you've actually played through it, then you can select where you want to start at. For now, let's uh, start the new game. Start a new game and jump in.
begin descent to surface. Copy. Disengaging. Initiating auxiliary thrusters. Command, we are 20 seconds to atmosphere breach. Initiate burn. Rotate on break. Primary ignition, set to 30%. Rotating. We are engine first. Altitude 20,000 feet and falling. Hold on. We are getting interference. Switch to high gain antenna. Command, confirm signal strength. You're looking great, Hold on. Go for landing. Engines off. Pod 1 has landed. Almost looks like home. That's what worries me. Well, boss, you're ready. Got my truck. And when snipers at three and six, multiple defense lines and an operating base established within the hour, move! Goodman? A word. You know the stakes of this mission. Flores is already half dismantled. Our engine's on its way down to power a city of half a million. Now, if these outrider bozos hit pay dirt, you report to me first. Sir, I'm only here to answer a proper procedure this fall. We're not on Earth, Shearer. There is no proper procedure. Listen up, outriders. I know what you're all thinking. There's no going home. And no one has a clue what's waiting for us out there. But the ECA pencil heads can't green like this land until we find their missing probes. So let's do our job. All right, here we go. First mission. Let's do our job. We haven't chosen a class yet, though. I wonder if that comes now. Yeah. Stretch my damn legs. I'll take point. Don't need to see you get eaten on day one. Relax, Outrider. You don't know me anyway. I wouldn't be here without you. I'd be buried in the ashes back home. <laughs> All right. Let's move out. Stay sharp. Watch our sixes. <sighs> Would you smell that air? I can't even process breathing air that doesn't smell like a burnt carburetor. I didn't mind the air back on Earth. Used to. <laughs> Trust me, you'll get used to fresh air too. Truth is, none of us should have even gotten off Earth. Survivor's guilt. You think any one of us isn't feeling it? It's not just that. If the Caraval's engine hadn't exploded back on Earth and killed most of the real outriders with it, there would be a bunch of mercenaries down here in their place. I hired you because you don't let anything get in your way. Okay, so pretty straightforward so far. I think it's pretty counterintuitive though to have the the climb on on B. <laughs> we'll make Usually it's on Outrider, set a beacon flat. Let HQ know the area is secure. Okay, we can do that. Interact with objects.
All right, people. We got jobs to do. Cuthbert, Scarstead, set up a perimeter. I want fortifications going up within the hour. Jakob, you're field testing the munitions. Gutman, get your scanner up and running so we can find those damn probes. Outrider, a word. Hey. No matter what happens out here, I need my best gun on this in case things go south. Can I depend on you? Just tell me what to do, Cap. Our weapons haven't been fired in nearly a century. Why don't you head over to Jakob and get your gear checked, and then be prepared to move out as soon as those probes are located. Any questions? No word from Earth, I assume? It's really gone. She went dark 15 years into our journey. More or less as predicted. ACA's confirmed no communication since. <laughs> Shit. You know, I uh, grew up a slum dog, fighting for scraps. Lost everyone, really, long before the end. Doomsday just wasn't a thing I worried about. Hell, it was never gonna live past 20 anyway. Somehow, <laughs> I was one of the ones who made it. Don't even know what I'm supposed to be doing here. As things go right, time's coming, you're gonna have to leave all that behind. This is a new beginning. You could have a family here, build a cabin, grow old and get fat. Yeah, that's not me, Cap. Know my way around bullets, not kids. There'll be no need for someone like me here. Maybe the old you, Outrider. But you're one of the chosen few. You get to build the future. Don't waste it. Did any more of your people make it off Earth, Cap? My brother. Almost. But no. They got him in cryo as we evacuated L.A. Hoping we could stop the bleeding. Ah, he was too far gone. Ah, shit. Sorry to hear that. I haven't had the time to think about it. What about Sarah? She's good, right? Yeah. My Sarah's up there. They don't wake her group for another six months, but I can wait. I'm, uh... I didn't have a chance to tell you this and all the madness, but my little girl's pregnant. That's how I got her the seat. <laughs> Two for one special, huh? So that's why I've been in such a good mood since they unfroze your ass. Don't push it out right. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir, granddad, sir. I'll go find Jakob's shooting range. Good. We're on standby for those probes, so stay on alert. Interesting. So everyone was like put into cryo. Because Earth was like destroyed. Hmm. We have access to new journal entries. Okay. Ah, oh, here we go. The people that we've seen so far, and everything else is locked, it seems like. Can find further information about characters, enemies, locations, collectibles, journals, and more. Oh, here we go. Enemies, history, and lore. All right, we'll leave that for now. Don't need to read everything. So talk to Jacob about field testing your weapons. Oh, here we go. We got a pistol and, a, and an assault rifle, seems like. What's on your mind, boss? I know that look you get. See you in a bit. What do you think about Enoch? That last day on Earth was a nightmare. Well, I think I'm ready for target practice. Time to test my gear. Uh, up for some target practice, boss. Let's get started. Sort of get the gist of what's going on. Don't need to know the whole background story. So what are we doing? Take cover behind the crates. Hey. Oh, okay. Ooh, fancy stuff. Yeah, a new toy. You're the first one to test it out, boss. Oh, yeah. The yeah, auto shoot, okay, we get it. 
think you could take on a tank? Did I ever mention how glad I am to be on your side? Damn. Somehow 80 years has improved. Now give that sidearm a try, eh? Alright, hold. Oh, it's weird you gotta hold it. Nice. Oh, it's you wielding. Switch back. Alright. It's definitely got that Gears of War fear where you can't just hold fire, right? Because it becomes too inaccurate. All right, so you feel like stop showing off. spray a little bit. Feels a lot better. Yep, still got it. Ammo crates will allow you to restock. Check on our okay. ECA rep. See if Shear has found any probes yet. Good to know. Good to know. Hey. Jonas can be unlocked in many ways. Look around, fight, complete quests, and try to unlock them all or collect them all. So. Oh my gosh, this is stunning. I wish you could have seen this third. Hey, you're Shira, right? I'm sorry. Can you believe this landscape? It's so beautiful. Oh, if only we had an internet to post those two. It's for a scientific record. Besides, we'll have the internet up and running in the first six months. The entire thing was backed up. I'm just pulling your leg, Shira. Any luck with the probe? The scan's still running. I don't know what else I can do, it's just... How can the probe signals have simply vanished? Yeah, they said it was some kind of interference or something. Not from space, maybe, but not from down here. Still, seems the initial readings were right, for breathing. Yes, but before the ECA can authorize half a million more people coming here, we need the probes data to know we can support them. And if we can't? What's the ECA's plan B? Do you have any questions I got answers to? How's this colonization gonna work? You're in the planning rooms, right? Yes. We've already started disassembling the engine. We need to bring that down first. The nuclear core should give us enough power to get the colony up and running. And when do the civilian pods start coming down? Within a few weeks, if all goes well. First, just enough people and resources to get our infrastructure running. You know, water, food, and shelter. Then we'll keep waking folks from cryo, a few thousand at a time, no more than we can feed. Until before you know it, you'll be standing in the middle of a city. Meanwhile, the Flora stays up there? The ship was built in orbit. It was never meant to land. We'll have to keep it in our skies until we're capable of space flight again. One day, maybe. Hey, is that supposed to blink that way? Oh, 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 oh. That's a probe. Tanner. I think we got a signal. It's close. Excellent work, Outrider. Now go locate the damn thing so we can land this beauty. Copy that. Hey, it's an historic moment. We should document it. For the scientific record, huh? <laughs> so, me being an Outrider already, does that mean I... Like, already have abilities? Like, powers? I don't know. I guess we'll find out, right? Heads up, I got movement. Nine o'clock, something big. All you to stay alert. Guard the perimeter. Hold your fire until we know what we're dealing with. Oh, they got eyes on some kind of 
hyena looking at the cow things. Yeah, I'm seeing them over here too. A whole herd of them. Are we sure all the wildlife around here are vegetarians? Herbivores? We call them herbivores? Whatever. They look pretty ugly, you ask me. No, they're, they're astonishing. I bet they can be domesticated, performing. Uh, I bet they make some fat, juicy steaks. No, uh -oh. there's one that went up here. Cause that is exactly where we uh, where we have to go. One of those cow things is sunning itself right on my path. Hey, maybe he can get close enough to get a DNA sample. Not exactly our priority, but oh, hang on. If I can get close without spooking it, I'll try. Oh, you can click on the next cover, and he runs to it automatically. That's interesting. Uh, scared it off, but I've secured the objective. Fantastic. Got some kind of storm brewing. Cap, yeah, found the probe. Looks like it landed pretty hard, but the data seems intact. Copy that. Transmitting to HQ now. Good work, Outrider. Hold on. Data? I'm picking up a second signal, but something's weird about this one. Weird? The pitch is rising and falling? It's supposed to be a steady tone. Outrider Alpha to HQ. Hold off on calling in that green light. We got another probe out here to analyze. Negative, Alpha. Your job is done. Damn it. Maxwell, listen to me. We can't afford to make mistakes. Give us time. Any more time and we lose our orbital window. We have the data. I'm calling it in. You want to keep searching? Don't blame me if you find trouble. Over and out. Uh, all right, Outriders. Rendezvous back with the convoy. Let's go find that stray. Back with the convoy, okay. So is that just where we were before? Do we have a map? Hang on. There's no map there. Mm, I'm not sure. Oh, we can sprint. That's good to know. Maybe we unlock the map later on. Oh wow, look at this. You can continue sprinting while changing the camera. I don't actually know a game that does that. Hey, Guthbert, any updates? The probe signal is mostly noise, but I've tracked its source. There. Hope you all brought your galoshes. Ooh. Jacob, mm. same shit, different planet. Ochevistia. Mm. <laughs> Electronics are freezing up. Trucks are down. We continue on foot. Soldier, your primary focus is here. Understand? We keep moving. Eyes up. Choke on your own spit, dude. It's nothing. I'm good. Jesus. Shit. Get back to the ship. Alert the medics. What's going on? Stay back. Get a medic to the side of the Tanner, got eyes on the probe. I got movement, heading in. <sighs> All 
a rifle. Here we go. HQ. We've encountered a potential biological hazard. Requesting quarantine procedure at base. Damn it, Tanner. I told you both that to go mess up this operation. It's my name on the line when it's landing, and you have no authority over me. Maxwell. Shit. Unit. Hey, boss, we lost you. I'm getting her straight probe. How's Scarstead? He looks like shit. Any idea what this black gunk is? Some kind of saprophyte or mycelium? But this collects samples. No, oh, here we go. This looks like some sort of some sort of arena here. Yeah, it's do it. Direction and press that to dodge enemy attacks. Oh yeah. Okay, you want to play? Then let's play. Oh what? Wow, you're getting quick with it. Bloody hell. Captain, got attacked by one of those cow things. Something drove it crazy. I had to put it down. Keep an eye out. Copy that, Outrider. Now move your ass and find that probe. Tanner, I found it. Good work. Get the drive, so get the hell out. Wait, hold on. This thing's just in relay mode. Tanner, the signal isn't coming from the probe. It's coming from outside our search zone, somewhere else on the planet. That's impossible. There is nobody else. Secure the hard drive. We'll analyze that signal back at base. Copy. Oh, damn it! Something's frying it, Tanner. Give us the frequency. Uh, carrier frequency is nine seven point. Tanner, do you copy? Oh, shit. Tanner, Tanner. I'm seeing some really strange shit down here. What the fuck? Dodged everything there. Pretty nice. Oh, 
Kurva! Kurva! Contamination. I need quarantine set up at base. Do you copy? Uh, uh, shit. Maxwell, what the fuck is all this? What does it look like? Sergeant Major, sir, we have to follow quarantine procedure and hold the landing. Whatever the original reports about this planet, they were wrong. There's some kind of anomaly. If we land now, everyone will die. There's no holding the landing. It's too late for that. There's nowhere else to go. <laughs> Tatter here! We need help! <laughs> we need medics! See to them! Hurry! No, stop. They're contaminated. If we contain them, that's an order. You always were an asshole. Look around you. We got men and women in need of medical attention. Now get your asses in gear and do the right thing, or I'm gonna have to... No! Contain this. Now. And burn the fucking bodies. Holy shit. Maxwell's lost his goddamn mind. I'll take care of their wounded. Just hold them back. Jacob, cover me. I'm going after Maxwell. Oh, whoops. I Three. got you. Say, hey. one button. Stand down. That's an order. Sure. Right after you call off your goddamn goons. Sergeant Major, the entire colonization is threatened. We need to warn the Florida. Your outriders are the ones who stirred up this threat, imperiled this mission. Bullshit. Oh, sweet. So hang on, open up inventory. So we can change weapons here, right? So firepower 103. Use your inventory screen to inspect any equipped gear. Choose a weapon or armor slot to select a category and then a particular item to equip it. Okay, so category, item. Not bad. And they have like extra bonuses and stuff. Well, this one does at least, because it's like a blue one, maybe? Killing shots detonate the enemy's bones and turn them into shrapnel that deals 60 damage and inflicts bleed on enemies within a 5 meter radius. Cooldown of 1 second. Wow. Alright, cool. That does feel a little bit different. Oh, we got bogeys! Maxwell set up a blockade. He's gonna burn everything down. Why? So he can tell the story his way. How the Outriders have fucked everything up. He needs to die. Outrider, wait. Maxwell is the only one who can call up the landing. He needs to get it to do reason. There we go. Oh, sometimes it's a little bit awkward to aim, hey? It, like, goes really slow. Oh wow, that feels awkward. To attack your enemies again. Okay? Yeah, like that.
Alright, may as well just run. Yeah. Kill the traitors! Don't let them near! Alright, we can take this guy out. Do we have a shotgun? Hang on, it says we have a shotgun, don't we? Oh, here we go. Who do you think you are? Oh, yeah. Do the right thing! Call it in! Postpone the fucking landing! Hey, you, can you help me with the wounded? We have to get them to Metla. Over here! Come on, move your asses! Almost there. Uh, you're gonna be fine. What are you doing? I'm putting you back into cryo until Medlab can save your fucking life. Don't be ridiculous. I'm done for. Pep talks aren't really my thing. When is something truly over? Was it when your people left Earth behind? Was it when you watched the first spaceship crash and burn? Was it when you saw your fellow Outriders crumble at your feet? Was it watching yourself die? But Enoch isn't done with you yet, Outrider. Like I always say, it ain't over till it's over. You, what year are you from? Year, what year? What? Is this your pod? Where were the uplink nodes? Come on, Doc. We need to go. They're coming. Wait, we can't just leave them here. These are outriders. They're not why we're here. I'm sorry. Uncuff me and find out! The anomaly is coming. Let's see how fast you can run! The no man's land! Like the others! Wow, okay. So, I guess we're in there for a while. Where the hell am I? Shut your goddamn mouth! Hey, soldier! You're ECA too, right? When we get to no man's land, we gotta stick together if we wanna survive. Survive what? Getting our asses fried by the big storm! Hey, I told you to shut the hell up! We're here! Come on! Go back! Go back! 
What the hell's happening? They've got an altar to tear your guys apart. We need to get out of here. But where are storms coming? You think the altar care about a storm? Shit, shit, shit. Take the back way through the fridge. We're not gonna make it. We're just talking about here. I got to cover. And while the captain of the show, I already have got it. Watch out! Okay, Steve. You outriders promised us. Guess what we've got instead? Goddamn alien storms! No shelter, no food. Just kicked to the curb like exiles while your ECA pals got fat in their bunker. Bullshit! It wasn't like that. We lost electronics. We could have left you all the rot in your cryopods. But we did it. We saved you ungrateful. <laughs> How many times did I tell you to shut up? <laughs> Welcome to the Valley of Death, asshole! Wow, brutal. Shit has hit the fan. Choose your path. Technomancer, Pyromancer, Trickster, or Devastator. So as far as I know, Technomancer is like the utility class. Deals out a little bit of damage, but I don't know, mainly there for the utilities and stuff. Pyromancer, I think that's pretty self-explanatory. Based on fire, Trickster, based on like slowing time and stuff, and Devastator is like the tank. That's about as much as I know so far. I think the one that's interested me the most is uh, Trickster. So I think we'll... We'll start it off with tricks, eh? Oh, here we go. Bend the laws of space and time to appear out of nowhere, assassinate your enemies, and return to safety in the blink of an eye. As a trickster, each enemy killed in close range heals you and grants a portion of shield. Let's do it. Are you sure you want to be a trickster? You won't be able to change your chosen path later. Yes.
Okay. Alright, here we go. Eyes up, Outriders. Welcome to the Outriders demo. In this demo, you'll be able to experience the first of many regions from the Outriders epic journey through Enoch. You'll be able to reach character level 7 and world tier 5. Okay. You'll also be able to hold a maximum of that many resources. So don't hoard spend. The demo has no time limit, so check out vendors, finish all side quests, and discover all the journal entries. So four side quests, interesting, and test all four classes. Okay. Thanks for the heads up. Out of here. As the trickster, you will recover health and gain a shield when you kill enemies in close quarters. This is the most effective way you can restore health during combat. Interesting. Okay, so kill people to restore health. I just gotta get across this hellhole. What the fuck's happening? I don't belong on this side. What in the? Oh shit. Skills: LB, right bumper, or use a skill from the sector. Oh, interesting. Okay. So right now we got this one. Oh, oh what? Did I do that? Oh, what's this happening? So we don't have our skill yet. But we should definitely try and use our skill here. Here we go. Let's Let's go for it. Oh dear. Wait for our skill, then we can go up and kill all them. Oh, sketchy. Oh, we like saved his buddy there. You know what? We can run up there. And use our skill. Here we go. Oh, what? They will just blow up. Fuck this! Run! Hold your position! They got a freak! Fall back! Okay, hang on. Did we just get some... Running for me? Did we just get some items? All right. Oh, we automatically put it I on. Get okay. Used to this. Because that's all we had. Makes sense. So far, not too bad. Well, everyone is just like against everyone, right? <laughs> right now, we have no friends. Maybe we should try and use our skill a little bit more. Oh, whoops. A little bit too... A little bit too hectic there. But it's alright. I mean, this is only world tier level 1, so I don't imagine it to be too... This flares. This bad. Storm. I've seen this before, in the forest, when we landed. There was also a new weapon, so let's check. Oh, okay, so we just automatically equipped it, right? It's 103. Either 100, is this a shotgun? Or what's this one, a sniper? A rifle, okay. A bolt-action rifle. Oh, 
Wow, okay. I feel like there's a lot of people on top, right? Can we climb up somewhere? No, not really. Ah, here we go. So let's check out this rifle. This can't be real. Uh oh. Seems like there's a boss over here. He's got like a skull on on his head. Yeah. Oh wow, here comes another one. Ooh, pistols. Okay, so far not too bad. The the spot that we have to go, it seems like it's in this direction. Oh, we can't go through here? Maybe we have to go all the way around then. Oh no? Wait, what? Ah, oh, that doesn't work. Oh, we probably have to kill everyone before we can continue, right? And we missed this one over here. Oh, whoops. Oh, headshot. Yeah, there we go. Slow trap. Oh, damn. That's it. Definitely have to try that. Well, it actually lasts a long time, hey? Okay, definitely going to have to try that out. Quest completed. So you actually have to kill everyone in the in the area before you can move on, okay. I could smell the storm in your blood, your stink of Enoch. Your kind are abominations, exile. Who the hell are you? Outrider. Impossible. Such untapped power, such confusion. You want answers. Whatever you were before, you're something new now. A second life. Don't waste it. Who... Who was that? Lord Seth? He's... He's altered. And he's a little man. A little man. Altered? What the fuck does that mean? You... <laughs> you don't know what you are. <laughs> Where'd you steal that uniform? Didn't. It's mine. Yeah? If he's really an outrider, then you fight's in the wrong side. Altered. What are you talking about? Yeah, yeah. Uh, the Grand Marshal, she'll explain. Come. Where is she? There. There. What is that? Go, go, go. Do whatever you have to do, Lieutenant. Shira? You're alive. I'm sorry to disappoint you. You came from their side. You got any intel for us? Are you fucking kidding me? Look, I got a war to win, so either you help me, or you get back into cryo. Hold on. I've just woken up to mud and shit. I've been asleep for God knows how many years. 31 years. So for 31 years, I've been seeing people fight and die while you were getting comfy in cryo. So excuse me for not throwing you a little welcome party. What happened to you? The anomaly. That's what happened. You mean that storm? 
We told them not to land. Anything more advanced than a grease engine that fried. All our data. Wiped out. We couldn't grow crops or make medicine. So we ended up in the same place as when we left Earth. Just killing each other over the little we have left. Why didn't you go somewhere else? The Outriders could have... The Outriders are dead. What? And the anomaly keeps us in this fucking valley. We can't go anywhere else. You don't get it, do you? You think you're dreaming? This is real. Believe me, it's fucking real. So whether you like it or not, you're stuck here in the mud and shit like the rest of us. You should have never woken up. Why well, didn't miss out on all this? Grandmother, we were too late. The hounds have him. He's been taken underground. Well, get him back. Well, it may be our side, but that's not our turf, ma'am. I'm not losing people over Yakub. Yakub? He's still alive? Not for much longer, it seems. Then I'll go find him. Ma'am? Ma'am? Never mind. We've got it covered. The insurgents took everything I had left. Wow, okay. So I think... Oh, did you see that? World Tier... Trouble and I need to go save his ass. You have rewards. World Tier 2? Oh, wow, okay. So it depends on how many enemies or how, many, how much experience I earn. I can up my World Tier. I'm not sure if we should do that now. Well, it does seem... Well, claim rewards. One reward claimed. Oh, so it is automatically on... On easy now. I think. I don't know. Still figuring this out. Okay. We'll keep it on world tier 2 for now. That's what it says it's on. Just because, you know, more rewards, better weapons. That always sounds good. So I think this is where we're going to stop it here. Thank you very much for watching. We'll continue on here in the next episode. Going to keep going through the main story. Thank you very much for watching. And I'll see you in the, in the next one. Have a good day, everyone. Cheers.